Hello and welcome to episode 8 of my Force of Nature tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on continuing the quests, starting with the quest Build a Hut of Branches. So if we go into the quest journal, you'll see that's the quest up there. So that's what we're going to do in the building menu. Let's get our nails first of all from the anvil. There we go. Okay, let's go now to the build menu and constructions and hut of branches. So I need two ropes. So let's go to the crafting rope and select, make two of them. Nice and quick. Enjoy that while you can because a lot of the stuff gets a lot slower. Okay, now let's go back to build, constructions, hut of branches, there you go, we can now make ourselves this building. Okay, so I'm going to select that. In fact, what I will do is walk to here. Let's cancel that. You can cancel when you've, you're making something by right-clicking the mouse. So let's do this again, build, constructions, Hut of branches, select that, and I'm going to place it just there. I love the way it just grids it all up and does the little arrow. They thought of everything, the developers. So we'll click that there. If we go take a look, you can see that this structure is going to take a little time, not too long, but it's going to slowly build. Okay, while that's building, what you should be doing is checking that you have enough of all of the resources. So, got 18 of them. 10 more coal. And let's smelt some more iron. Let's do two more. Let's do some more coal. And let's have a look at the glowing embers. So I'm going to do some more of them as well. And this is what you should be doing, always keeping a stock supply in your pocket because you're going to go through resources like n nobody's business anyway let's go to the encyclopedia quickly because in the last episode we gained level four so the new items we can make at level four are nails rocks splinter studded stone cudgel trap and wooden tongs well i've made the wooden tongs and the nails already the splinter's a bit strange because that's what we've been picking up. Maybe this is... Yeah, no, I've been picking them up, so that's a bit strange. But we can now craft them, apparently. And rocks. So I guess this is a uh, range weapon. Because it does 12 damage, so not too shabby. And uh, quicker than my... Um, stone mace because that's only 0 0.63 so it's quicker to throw stones okay so they're the items that we can now make oh yeah this stone studded cudgel the damage is 21 but the attack speed is 0 0.53 so 0 0.10 slower than my stone mace and it only does one more damage so I think I'll just stick with the stone mace. Yeah. Oops. Let's grab them. And let's make some more. Oh, I'm going to need sticks. I've nearly run out of sticks. Right, let's go gather some sticks. Uh, 
and the sticks of course are not from these bushes they're from these ones there we go sticks Let's go check how we'd... Oh, my stone hut is built. Look at that. There we are. How cool does that look? Okay, when you walk inside, the roof disappears. So you can see what you're doing. Now, if we go to the quest journal and check out what we got to do next, we now have to build a craft table. So, we go to uh, buildings menu, constructions, and craft table. For this, we need 20 planks, 15 nails. So I need to do five more nails. So let's do that first of all, and then 20 planks. So back to the anvil. And we want to do 10 more nails. Oh, I haven't grabbed my uh, ingots. So let's grab them. Now do the nails. While it's doing the nails, let's now do some planks. So if we go to the crafting window by pressing the C key, click on planks, you can see we're going to need logs to do this. Now it was 20 planks that it said, so that's going to be quite a few. We get three for each lot though, so there we go, 21. Okay, so that's now going through. We'll just wait for that. And let's see what we short of. So really I need some more logs and branches. So let's cut some trees while we're waiting. Make efficient use of our time. Oh, and there's some strawberries. Let's grab them. lots of logs see occasionally you can get pine cones which suggests we can plant more trees so that's cool Okay, let's have a look. How are we doing? What was I waiting for? Our nails. Okay, so we got our nails. Uh, let's see if we can now build the crafting table. The crafting table can only be built in a building, so that's why you had to make the hut of branches. So let's go into constructions and craft table oh I'm still waiting for the planks ok let's go to crafting how lucky is that look at that just nearly finished how cool 
There we go, grab the planks, go back into build, constructions, craft table, and there you go. Can only be placed indoors. So let's select that. See out here it's all red, but as soon as we go in here, it's green. Okay, that is now going to take a little while. It's not too bad actually. We can watch that go. Let's do the inventory. You can see the nice progress we're making here though. We're, get, we're making all of these um, structures to make us different items and so we're turning the raw resources into refined, refined resources and making ourselves some really nice structures now like this hut of uh, straw. Near a bit of lightning there and see it. Oh, it's getting dark. There we go, there's our crafting table. Let's go into the quest log and take a look. Okay, so now that we have a crafting table, we're able to craft traps. So let's have a look at this quest. With the help of the trap, you can catch and tame some animals. It now wants me to craft 15 traps. The trap can be crafted on the table, so let's take a, take a look at that. Okay, if we click the table and then recipes. So you can see on the crafting table, we can make um, a lot of the items that we can make in our pocket. But the one we want, of course, is here, traps. That would be very nice, pocket lamp. Hopefully that will shed enough light for me to record as I walk around. Instead of having to wait for daytime at the end of each episode. Okay, oh look, and check that out. There's how we're going to get a bow. Really looking forward to that. Okay, let's do the trap. So we need 15 of them. So in order to make 15, I've got enough sticks now. But I need to make a load of ropes. Fortunately, oh no, I've used up a ton of my uh, fond leaves. Okay, so let's make some ropes. Um, how many did I need? So it uses two, and I need to make 15, so 30. 30 ropes. And I've only got half what I need. So let's do the half that I can do. While that's doing that, let's go cut a load of font frond leaves. And they, of course, are from these. See, I'm letting my stamina build up each time before I have to go and do any of this. And that way I'm ready and prepared for it. I'm keeping it moving. Now this is a real nice beachfront uh, property, isn't it? People pay a lot of money for this. Be right by a lovely beach with clear blue water. Oh, let's go check that out see if I can put the other half I need on. Okay, so we want 15 more ropes. While that's making them ropes, we're going to go chop some more of these bushes. There's the timer. 
Time is never on our side, I'm afraid. Okay, well, I shall leave it there and carry off straight from where we leave off here. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep every last one of you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.